Tea Time True Crime with Katie and tonight's story is sad just like a lot of the cases I cover but this case is still going and the crime is pending because this just happened last Friday. Abigail Zwarner was a teacher who was teaching her class in the middle of her teachings a six-year-old pulled out a nine millimeter handgun and shot her in the hand. And then the bullet went through her hand and into her chest. This case is still pending. Since the child is only six years old, the child will not be brought to prosecution. Instead, Newport News, Virginia say, the police, um, they say that the parents will be liable. The mother actually, owned the gun. So she is facing right now misdemeanor charges. Abigail is a hero. Students were first witness account of the shooting. There was crying, there was screaming. It was just a horrible scene. They're, they're kids, okay? But even after her horrible injury, she got all her students out of the class to safety before she got any medical attention. A staff employee actually saw the shooting occur, ran into the classroom and got the gun out of the six-year-old hand because sadly, even though it was shot fired once, there were multiple rounds in that magazine. It was absolute chaos Friday. There were hundreds of parents on the scene in Newport News, of course, worried about their children, but it was only sadly one teacher shot and she was a hero, save the classmates. And of course, another hero who got the gun out of the kid's hands and just, just stopped a horrible situation from happening. Like it could have been way worse. I can't believe a six-year-old people. Crime is still pending and there is going to be a court case January 20th for the arraignment actually about what is going to happen to the child's mother who actually had the handgun in her name. As of right now, Newport News schools do have metal detectors in the secondary schools and now they're really thinking about putting metal detectors in elementary schools. Currently, for the time being, Abigail's condition is stable. They say in the hospital, she is doing very well, which is incredible. And now for the kids, next week, there is no school for mental health reasons. Abigail and the staff, you are heroes, like, oh, my God. I will do my best to keep you updated on the case, but for now, thank you so much for watching and remember you're doing better than you think.